Dextra Frankel was the gallery director at Cal State Fullerton. She and I became friends through an artwork that we did with Oliver Andrews, who was the head of the sculpture department at UCLA. And I asked her, why don't we do an exhibition of landscape architecture? And that gave me uh, the courage to just get on the phone and call up all of these different people and say, wow, how would you like to be part of a show, part of a gallery show at Cal State Fullerton? I'm organizing this and I would love for you to be a part of it. And pretty much everybody that I called wanted to participate and came up with a big idea. It was a lot of fun and it really um, helped to make myself more known. Um, I hear I am struggling to try to get something more than just residential projects um, and really wanting to have larger scale projects to work on. So this was an opportunity for that, working with Dexter Frankel on this show uh, called Six Views. Everybody that I knew, I would talk to. Lloyd Amaral, Craig Codgetts, Ron Wigington, all kinds of people that would just call up and see if I could get them to participate in it. And yes, they wanted to, which was really amazing for 1986 for landscape architects to have a show. And I think there was an article in the paper about it. And so we felt like we got some notoriety out of it. At least we got somewhere on Pete's through his antenna and also through George Hargraves. So there we are in Southern California where it's hard to get noticed. This is the land of television and movies and there is a lot more exciting news than what landscape architects are doing. I think trying to get landscape architects noticed is a, is a big deal because people take it for granted. And there's so much that goes into um, developing landscape and working with a client, uh, knowing about grading and drainage, uh, knowing about materiality and how we can begin to use innovative um, materials. Unexpected. What can we do to call attention to our work that is real, but has a, a certain kind of quality to it? where things are edited out. It's better what isn't there than what is there.